Hi guys, welcome to the multi-award winning Emerald House of Cars. We're a totally unique family run business on a mission to be the best car dealership in the UK. Our commitment is to give you guys the best buying experience you've ever received, whether you plan on purchasing completely online using our free next day delivery service with seven day money back guarantee, or you're coming to the showroom to meet the team. We've made everything as easy and as transparent as possible so that you've got full confidence in choosing Emerald for your next car. A little later in the video, we'll show you how our vehicles are prepared before sale in our on-site RAC approved service center. But for now, sit back, relax, and enjoy the following video. Hello there guys, and welcome to this quick virtual walk around of the gorgeous mountain grey metallic Mercedes-Benz AMG line premium. Now this A200D is of course the diesel option on the popular, very popular even, hot hatch that Mercedes offer. Finished in mountain grey with a night pack, you've also got the aero pack and you've got the multi-spoke 18 inch AMG alloys. You can see that it's a car that really doesn't need any introduction and one that simply looks the bees but also offers great economy, not poor return on MPG. In easy speak, it's got everything that you would hope for. So Greg, why is this such a cool car and why should the people watching this video want to have this delivered to their house or come and collect it? in less than 24 hours. Well, here are the reasons. First one is, of course, that mountain grey metallic, which you can see in this light, gives it a real gorgeous shimmer and a real deep, rich gloss feel to the paintwork. Down here, you've got the LED high-performance headlights, which, of course, form part of the premium pack, and you've got LED daytime runners, you've got front parking sensors, and as part of the night pack, you've got the gloss black grille, you've also got the gloss black canyons there with a the honey crown grille, and you can see you've got the gloss black front splitter, and it moves all the way around, giving it a real, real aggressive stance and real naughty appearance. You can see the first of the alloy wheels, the 18 inch multi-spoke, of course finished in diamond cut with the gloss black and the red AMG caliper just behind. Part of the AMG line, of course Mercedes AMG Motorsport Group, you get the flared side skirts, you also get the black mirrors, and you also get the D-chromed window surrounds. You can see the car, absolutely gorgeous order a real real statement piece and a joy to behold now the main thing on the aero pack that people really like is of course the big naughty rear wing on the back which give you that real statement presence and real vibe that it's a true out and out performance car yes you can get them on the old a45s but you can also get them on these which just totally transforms the nature and the soft look of a generic a-class Moving down, you've got your Mercedes-Benz LED rear lights, and you've got your rear parking sensors. You've also got down here your gloss black vents and canyons and gloss black diffuser with the dual chrome exit exhaust. And you can see it's just a really, really good looking car from every single angle. Now the boot itself isn't actually all that bad. Now a lot of people think that A-classes are too small, but that is more than ample to do every day-to-day -day items, city running, even, to be honest, if you've got a buggy rather than a pushchair, if you've got children, you can get that in there at the diagonal or straight across without any questions asked. It's nice, it's spacious, and it's quite deep, and you've also got sufficient storage underneath there as well. It's not an electronic boot, it is, of course, push, so you have to push that down in order to move it. But you can see moving around that mountain grey metallic with a night package which is of course a black styling just goes right at home grey and black at the minute has been the trend for many many years now and it shows now signs are slowing up it's an incredible car to look at and if it offers great economy as well as great looks well that just ticks every box surely but the one box it does tick that we haven't yet shown you is inside where the premium cabin awaits so Moving on inside the A200D, you can see not only have you got the electric folding door mirrors, but you have also got a load of tech, an awesome interior to keep your company on any drive you've got. Of course, the first thing you notice on the interior is this. So it's the raw carbon fiber weave that's etched all the way across the center console. Mercedes call it the checkered flag design, but it really is a carbon weave and it just looks incredible. You've got your flat bottom steering wheel, of course, which in the Napa leather with the half perforated leather and the red contrast stitching. And then you've got the best thing about the interior. You've got the sport seats, which are really nice and sculpted. Half leather, which is the Ice Caramel made leather. 
and the Dynamica suede all down the centre. And you've also got the red contrast stitching on those. And fun fact, they only extend. And you've also, once you've extended it, if you need, you've got further storage with a drawer just under the chair. You can see that these are, of course, manually adjustable seats, as Premium Pluses only have the electric. So you've got aluminium sports pedals, automatic lighting, parking brake, key for your ignition just there. And you can see it's just such a cool little place to be. There's nothing in there that's lacking or anything missing. Now on the door card, before we get into the car, that's also the Artico leather and the Dynamica suede. You can see you've got your folding electrically adjustable mirrors and electric windows. Also down the bottom, you do have an illuminated door inlay as well. Now in the rear, you can see you've got the same seating in there, and it's also got that real nice little bit of leg room at the back as well. A lot of people think that A-classes are too small, but unless you're taking all people as big as our Tom in there, who's six foot seven, you're not gonna struggle. It's a really nice place to be, and it's really, really exquisitely designed and finished off really, really well. So getting in, first thing you'll notice is you drive to be you're not too low down you can see all the road and it's just a real nice stylish bespoke comfortable place now you can see the mileage it's done 59,310 miles at the time of doing this video that may change as we do do marketing with our cars for our youtube and social media platforms as well let's turn it on foot on the brake and you put your key in let the doors go and turn it right round to the right and jobs are good and you can see it starts with no issues, no faults, and no warning lights on the dash. What you can do, you can change the mileage on the mileage, sorry, you can change the display on there by using the left hand controls on the steering wheel. You can see you've got your range, you've got your eco display, you've got your trip meters, and you've also got a digital speedometer just there. If you click across, you can get a navigation, which of course isn't anything to do with the virtual cockpit, it just gives you the instructions to follow on your current journey. You've also got your audio, which is FM and AM. You've got your Bluetooth. You've also got your assistant. So if you click on the graphic here, you can see it brings up a virtual roadway and that will inform you of any obstructions or any, any instruction as well that you need to really pay attention to. You've also got your attention assist, which measures how long you've been driving and recommend when you take a break. Back on the assist, you've got electronic stability, brake assist, and the aforementioned attention assist as well. If you go on service, the main one you need, apart from tire pressure, is Assist Plus, and that tells you what service is due and when, and of course you can see it's just under a year, so that means total reassurance for the foreseeable future. And if you go on settings, you can change your instrument cluster, you can also change your lighting, so you've got DRLs, you can also change your vehicle settings in there, your winter speed limit, your automatic door locks, and whether it makes a noise. You can also go on convenience features such as your folding mirrors and you can change this and customise it really to tailor it to your own needs. Now on the steering wheel again itself you have of course got your Lingotronic voice control, Bluetooth telephone, volume control and mute and on this side again that is to control the instrument cluster. Behind there you've got what Mercedes call one store which is wipers and of course the rear wipers and indicators. And that's because this side is your gear stick so it's really simple to use basically put your foot on the brake if you want to drive press it down and you'll see in the instrument cluster it changes to d1 if you want to go into reverse you push it up and you know that happened because you get your reverse camera if you want to put it in park simply click this button in and that's now in p the reason mercedes have done this is because they feel that it wastes too much space having it there when you can have storage or other accessories and it's something that i think is really really effective but do be aware don't ever click this up when you're driving if you come to an emergency stop or anything like that to, or when you think it's your wipers or anything daft because you are likely to have quite a big problem and quite a hefty bill at the end of it in terms of your lighting you can see just down here you've got your auto lights and your fog lights and we'll move around now on to the media system itself so it's not touch screen it is a tablet style but it is controlled by this little gizmo here which is the iDrive as such so you can see you've got navigation you've also got your radio media telephone and vehicle now on navigation it is around through the little sd card here which is garmin and you're probably familiar with the garmin layout and how well their sat navs work you can see it's high contrast high resolution and really simple to use you can click on the map or you can click on where to and you can put in all your destinations 
in terms of radio you have only got fm and am there is no dab as that again is reserved on for the other models such as the premium pluses if you click on the media you can see you've got a cd in here but we're going to turn that down because we don't want that on but you've also got other different options on the media as well so if you go down which we can get onto just here you can see you've got disc you've got bluetooth you've got media memory card and back to your cd as well and if you click on telephone you can of course easily click on connect device and you can connect your mobile phone ready for all talking and bluetooth audio streaming click on vehicle you can change your settings to locator illumination you've got your interior lighting shut off when you turn the car off the exterior and you've got your ambient lighting here which is of course multicolor I'm quite ashamed to say that Big Chad hasn't set it to emerald green but don't worry that's where your boy GXE comes in and you can see you've also got the ambient lighting brightness and the interior welcome light as well if you go on dynamic select that is of course your drive select mode meaning you can configure the individual mode to your own personal specification so for me i would have that in manual i would have the steering in sport i would have the eco start stop off and i would have the climate control on eco so somebody's already set this up for the optimum way to drive it you can also get your consumption figures your owner's manual change of time as well and if you go down onto the last menu you'll be able to see when I can get down on there that you do have the system settings menu and that on there basically just entails that you are able to do little bits and bobs and you're able to change all the little features such as your volume your rear view camera your setup assistant and you can reset it to factory standards for us though we're going to put it on the nav because we think it's the best looking display on there now in that carbon weave and the checkered flag design you can of course see you've got the x shape hexagonal and the real nice different sharp angular styling on the air vent system and that of course goes through down onto here with your air conditioning so you do have here you have auto you've got dual zone so that means basically i can turn it down for the passenger and i can turn it right up for the driver if i don't want dual zone and i want them synced i simply press that and it sets all the temperature of the car the same in each zone temperature is adjusted by using the dials just here i've got heated front screen heated rear screen and this is where i control the distribution of air into the cabin if I also click on mode, you can see I can see where the air is distributed in. And I've got recirculation just here and air conditioning or non air con there. If I don't want it on at all, I can simply click turn off. And just up from there, you have, of course, got your old school media system here, which is touch button, which will take you back onto the screen up there. Here, you've got your dial pad for any telephones or CDs. You also got heated seats, driver and passenger, dynamic drive select. And you can see you've got four different modes on there you've got eco comfort sport which is obviously the better one or individual which is the one we tailor made earlier and you can turn your audible parking sensors off by clicking that button just there inside you can see you've got 12 volt charger and a little bit of storage and here you've got further storage ideal for a wallet coins or any rubbish you have when you're a dad on the road trust me i know that feeling here you've got your iDrive, your favourites button and your back button and of course you've got your credit card holder, dual cup holder and a little bit of ambient lighting. Now on the Nappa leather armrest that of course does have the red contrast stitching you can see it slides and if you click the button up here you can open that up and you're greeted by your second media faces as well just there. So really that is pretty much everything. Epic looking mercedes-benz a200d amg line premium it looks the part it drives the part and most importantly it's got all the tech to keep everybody happy now one other thing that you need to know about this car is of course that it's been treated to the emerald 128 point check prior to retailing and that entails well that means that our experienced team of body shop guys and mechanics have given it a thorough cosmetic and mechanical check over before it's come for me to do this video you can see the results of that on our web page under 128 point inspection and we also welcome finance and part exchange so do please if you have any inquiries give us a call and we'll be more than happy to help but for me thank you very much for watching this video and we'll speak to you very soon one of the most important factors when buying a used vehicle is figuring out who to trust 
Buying a car is a massive financial commitment and you need to be 100% confident in the company that you choose. We have over a thousand five-star reviews on Google, Facebook and Autotrader, hundreds of video testimonials and the jewel in the crown are the multitude of awards we've won over the past number of years, including UK Independent Dealer of the Year, Independent Community Dealer of the Year and most recently, Used Car Retailer of the Year. Integrity and transparency are really important to us at Emerald in how we conduct our business. We're the only dealership with a multi-award winning weekly YouTube show, which pulls back the curtain and lets you see the inner workings of how a car dealership operates. We cover all aspects of the day-to-day -day running from buying, selling, sourcing, after sales, and of course, everything that goes on over at our RAC approved workshop. Every one of our car undergoes a 128 point vehicle inspection by our team of experienced technicians. Any item that aren't up to our approved standards, we rectify and replace parts needed with manufactured approved parts. We also service every car and put a fresh MOT on ready for its next owner. When we are happy the car is in A1 mechanical condition, over it goes to our body shop for paint correction or wheel refurbishment, then finally onto our detailing team. Essentially, we want to ensure that when the car reaches its new owner, it's at its very best. For the road ahead, we've got you covered with a comprehensive 90-day warranty, which can be extended for one, two or three years, depending on your preference. We are proud to be partnered with the market-leading warranty providers that match up to our own high standards, providing customers with genuine support when they need it. We've also got you protected for all unfortunate circumstances, such as having your car written off or stolen throughout your time holding the vehicle. We're really pleased to be able to offer a great RAC gap and return to invoice insurance product, keeping you safe long after you've left our showroom. If you are local to us and want us to take away the headache of keeping your car well maintained, our service plans could be just the ticket for you. Payable monthly and carried out in our fully equipped RAC group garage, every service comes complete with a free health check to keep you and your vehicle safe and secure on the journey ahead and also protect the future value of your car by maintaining that all important service history. And when it comes to protecting your car's interior and exterior against stains, scuffs, contaminants, all of our encompassing Gardex paint and fabric protection ensure the aesthetic appearance of your new vehicle remained unaltered and improved to an almost better than new finish. It's a great opportunity to protect against the best and worst that Mother Nature has to offer. And last but not least, if you do need to take out finance for your new vehicle, we have a panel of over 35 lenders, including Santander, with rates as low as 7.9% APR, always guaranteeing you the lowest possible interest rate. For a fee finance check, which won't affect your credit rating, click the finance tab on our website to fill out a two minute application that lets you know beforehand what your monthly payments are likely to be. We've got loads of PCP, HP, and lease options available, depending on your personal preference and budget. So if you want to speak to me or my team of finance experts for any help and advice, please don't hesitate to pick up the phone, we're here to help. Our goal at Emerald is not just to sell cars, it's about creating lasting relationships and customers for life. But don't just take our word for it, here's what some of our customers had to say about their very own Emerald experience. And how would you rate us out of 10? 10 being probably the best car dealership in the UK. Definitely 10. Oh, I'd definitely say 10. I'm going to say 10. 10. 10, obviously. 10. 10, I suppose. <laughs> Definitely a 10. I would give you a 10. Ah, it's got to be a 10. I'd give you a 10. Well, it's obviously a 10, isn't it? Obviously a 10. Mate, it's more than 10. Can I say 11? Straight million. <laughs> Straight, Straight million. Why more than 10? I would say 10. Oh, I'd go as far as saying 11. Definitely a 10. 10, yeah. A 10? I can say 10. In the 11. UK. Well, it's got to be a 10. Definitely a 10. If I could give you more than a 10, I definitely would. <laughs> I'd definitely say a 10. 10. I'd give you a 10. I'd give it a solid 10. I would say 10. 10 out of 10. I'll give you a 10 then. Sounds good. Give us a 10. 10. But I'll give you a 10 out of 10. It's got to be a 10. <laughs> I'll give you a 10. But I would rate you a 10. So 10 out of 10. 100%. It's got to be 10 out of 10, oh, right? That's an easy one, isn't it? It's 11. 11 out of 10. I'll give you 10. Perfect. Because I came back, didn't I? <laughs> and I'll Perfect. be back again. <laughs>